Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Rob from the Campbell Chronicles here with DVC Shop and thanks for joining us today. Today we're gonna head over back over to the parks, over to Epcot more specifically, and we're gonna discuss one of my, what's grown to be one of my favorite places to eat at. We're gonna give the Regal Eagle a little bit of a dining review. Before we get started, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Let us know what you think about Regal Eagle in the comments below. Is it something that you like? Something you haven't tried yet? You wanna give it a shot? Put it in the comments, we'd love to hear from you. Well, today we're gonna to break it up into three different categories and give it an overall score. We're gonna talk about theming, food quality, and service. Regal Eagle is located over there in the American Pavilion, and it's fairly new. It's been up for a while, but it's fairly new compared to some of the other restaurants in the park. And so let's go ahead and just get started. Let's go ahead and talk about the theming. Theming here is great. It's designed after a, a colonial American type era where uh, just the, uh, you're located in that center pavilion where the restaurant actually is. It's a beautiful building, um, decorated, colored, very beautiful. I, I love it. I just, I really can't really knock, I just can't knock anything off the theming of this because it fits very well with the restaurant. Now this restaurant, you go inside or you mobile order now and you go inside, you pick up your food and you can eat inside or you can take it out with you. Either way, you're you're able to eat around this American colonial type vibe and it's just really fun. So definitely two thumbs up for the theming. Next, let's talk a little bit about the food quality. So the food there, I'll be honest, it's pretty good. I really liked it. I got the pulled pork burger, which was just right up my alley. I loved it. I loved it a lot. It was really good. I also was able to try the pulled brisket on the Texas toast sandwich. Also really good. But I will tell you right now, what stood out to me the most was the onion rings. The onion rings, I am not exaggerating when I say they are the best onion rings I've ever had. They were really good. So as far as the food quality goes, I'm going to give that another two thumbs up. Now let's talk a little bit about the service. This is a quick grab take your food and sit down and eat kind of deal. So it's not like a, a waiter that's gonna be serving you, but I will say this, they keep the place clean. The tables are wiped down right away. There's no real issues with that. So as far as service goes, yeah, definitely two thumbs up on that one as well. So yeah, obviously this restaurant's gonna get two thumbs up all around. It's really, really good from the, the brisket to the pulled pork burger, and of course the onion rings. I mean, the regular fries were good, but I'm telling you right now, those onion rings, they were just, screaming at me they were so good so definitely two thumbs up for everything today let me know what you guys think in the comments below and if you would like to see more of our adventures head over to our channel we're called the campbell chronicles and we do all things family travel and disney so if any of those are of value to you definitely consider checking our channel out because we got a lot of fun planning the store we got cruises we got trips regularly we do giveaways we just have a lot of fun head over to the campbell chronicles and we'll put a link in the description below thanks again for watching guys we'll see you real soon